Leah just brought a loom band. Was it a loom brand? A loom band bracelet? No, it was a bracelet that Bessie made a girl's game. And it's broken. Yeah. So maybe a bigger sister can fix the thingy. No, look away, look away. Look away, look away. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to real life where you have a person, which is me, who has children who are around and life continuing on. But I wanted to show you today that I will be changing over my decor on my shelf. So this is the only display area that I have in my entire home where I put various things on it that I like to look at and years ago I actually had a whole huge china cabinet and I had all sorts of things stored away in tubs and waiting for that one day maybe one day I'll have the space or I'll live in the house that I can display all these wonderful treasures in and then in 2014 when I really started the beginning of my living simply journey and decluttering and owning less and shaking off the worry and everything else I now pretty much only keep the things that I love and I use and I don't really have things squirreled away for that house that maybe one day I'll have I have the things for the house that I currently have in the house that I live in, which is a regular house. It's older, it could do with probably tons of renovation and change and fixing up, but it's our home and it's full of people. And we're, are we happy people, Sarah? Yes. Yeah, we're happy people. So you will get to join me today as I switch over the decor stuff I have to stuff that's more suited to our current season, which is autumn. <laughs> so, with my lovely children around, I will do my best to show you what I've got, and hopefully it inspires you a bit to just enjoy the home that you have and display some things. My home doesn't have any pot plants in it or any low decorations because the design of this home it's there's nowhere like the house is full of people and I have little kids and stuff so I don't really want to have all these low down temptations but anyhow I'll, I'll get out the stuff that's more fall autumn type things and it will be tremendous All of my decor stuff that's like for the shelves I keep in a drawer in my bedroom and I do have some things that are actually uh, my daughter's but she preferred to keep them in here because it sort of keeps everything safe especially away from little two-year-old brothers so I will grab out all of my autumnal things and then everything that I'm taking off the shelves will come back into here. And I will tell you, one of the things I love the most about like decorating is I just use what I like. I use what I have, I use what I like, and then it's kind of like it is on trend in a way. The more sort of genuine nature about it means that it does suit the house and it does look good. So that's my story and I'm sticking to it. Um, but yeah, so use what you have, use what you love. Don't get caught up on what the internet tells you is on trend. If you really like something, use it.
I have a clean slate, I've taken everything down, and all I need now are my imagination, my hands, and my stuff, and a chair. <laughs> so that's all I need, and I'll put everything up, and then I'll show you the finished product. I hope that joining along with me today as I swapped over the shelves, the seasonal changeover to my autumn decor, that you can see that really it's just putting up a few things, the things that you like, enjoying them. I love not only the memory that's kind of attached to each thing that I have, but like the fact that they were either gifted to me or I got them from uh, an op shop or a thrift store, or I found them on the side of the road, or it was just something that someone else didn't want to own anymore, and that I can enjoy them for many years. So I don't really have many rules, except for the fact that the decor stuff fits in that drawer that I showed you. That kind of helps me keep fairly minimal with what I have, is having a designated place that I can go to, and obviously the spaces that were made from me taking these items out were the perfect spaces to put the anniversary, summery, Valentine's Day-ish things, pinkish things in that drawer. So yeah, I do realize when I do these videos that I say the word so a lot. I don't know why, but I do. I nearly said it again. Thanks for watching my video. If you have recently done videos switching over, I know being in Australia, we're like upside down and people are getting all excited about spring and summer coming. But if you've done any kind of like decor, decorate videos, I would love to see them. So make sure you let me know if you have a YouTube channel or even Instagram and I can check you out as well. And what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna make a coffee, and I'm gonna enjoy it, and I'm gonna enjoy the sound of the rain. I will see you in the next video. It's supposed to rain for like quite a few days. I think all the amazing weather is kind of now taken to Canada and America land, and it's gonna be wintry now, but that's okay. Any weather's good weather. That's what I say. Do I? Yeah, any weather is good weather.